What's up guys? Lotus 420 here. It's a beautiful day on the lake. Not very many people out here. I'm trying to come out here for a while and there's been bunches and bunches of people. We're out here. We got the boats. Well, two of the boats. Um, I think I figured out the big one. That one might be coming soon. So uh, probably work on that later tonight. See if I can get it going. But uh, today we got the Blackjack Nitro and the uh, little rescue boat that is very slow. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm going to get this together and uh, get this thing fired up and this on my head. And we'll run the Blackjack for a while. See you in a second. All right, guys. I think I got this to where you can see as long as I kind of stand back just a little bit. So... Let's go ahead and open her up here. Set that off to the side. I need a igniter. I need this guy and the drill. Make sure that's turned down a little bit so uh if it floods it won't kill it Switch over here. Turn that guy on. Plug it in the right way. Alright. Don't you fall, Mr. Igniter. Lock, lock, lock. <coughs> oh, let's just throw this guy in there and test the waters. So that's working pretty good. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. All right, guys. Let's uh, see what we get.
Way too rich. Yeah. Oh, it's always problems with this thing. All right, let's go get it. Bring it back in and lean it out. Man, the struggle is real with the rescue boat. <sighs> Should make for a long, entertaining video, though. Maybe that's the trick is just to push from the side. Oh, she gets slippery. All right. Oh. <laughs> I guess it's stuck there for a while. It'll be all right. All right, let's open this guy up and lean him out a bit. At least nothing's actually broken. Uh, let's set this over here so we don't lose anything. All right, screwdriver. All right, so I think we're gonna lean this guy out. Wow, that's so loose. That's so loose. Oh man, I wonder if this uh, O-ring is crapped out on us now. Well, only one way to find out: lean it out, and throw it back in. So we put a good turn on it. Let's uh, get it fired back up and throw it back in the water. It would be really nice if you could start this without the top on it.
Ha! Huh. Immediately dies out. get this one figured out so <clears throat> I think I realized that the upper needle or the high end needle seems like it might be leaking so I think we're gonna pull it all the way out take a look at the uh, o-ring in it and if it's not good then we're probably gonna try something the old hybrid trick screwdriver you can tell it looks like it's real wet and it's super loose I'm here I'm here buddy Yeah, he's pretty, pretty flat. He sticks out a little bit, but not a whole lot. And it's definitely, I think stuff is seeping past it. All right, let me see what I got here. Yeah, old Milwaukee. Conserve battery power here. Even if this don't work, I don't care about this O-ring. I got more at home. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this monkey off. I don't care. This is what happens when you take your work to work every day. I don't even know where I picked up tape at. All right, there it goes. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna steal a little chunk of lime. Uh, let's see. Stuff that back on there real good. Alright. I think my piece needs to be just a little bit thinner. Trim him up just a little bit if we can. I'm 
Trying to get that do it on the bench feeling. There we go. Alright. So now we're gonna slip him in place of the O ring. If we can. Go on there. Just go to your new home. Don't you want to go to your home? It's got that nitro oil on it. It's kind of slippery. Yeah, let's try this. There we go. All right, so got him up there in the groove hopefully we can run him in morning I don't know if it wants to go but it's gonna go on the radio Keeps beeping at me. All right, well, I got it to go in, but I think it just pushed it right out. <laughs> oh, that's some hood rat shit right there. Did it get all of it or? Oh. Might have to try again with therapies. <sighs> yeah, fuck that up. a little better let's try that yeah now we're down in there yeah. I don't know though that doesn't seem like it's really sealed very well I'll try it so on this one it is all the way down half one half two half I'll take it back to a quarter because that's pretty lean or uh, rich for break in then their factory settings and see if it'll even start for us I guess you might actually want that
Well, we got her to idle and run. That's good. All right. So, I think we're going to lean out that high side about eighth of a turn. Let's see how we feel. Oh yeah, she's still pretty cold. Give her a good little bit. Throw the top back on, throw her back out. Shit, you might want to start it first. Very, very important part. Why didn't you guys tell me? You didn't even help me out. I think I got this to where you can see as long as I kind of stand back just a little bit. So let's go ahead and open her up here. Set that off to the side. I need a igniter. I need this guy and the drill. Make sure that's turned down a little bit so uh if it floods it won't kill it Switch over here. Turn that guy on. Plug it in the right way. Alright. Don't you fall, Mr. Igniter. Just throw this guy in there and test the waters. So that's working pretty good. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. All 
All right, guys. Let's uh, see what we get. Way too rich. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's always problems with this thing. All right, let's go get it. Bring it back in and lean it out. Man, the struggle is real with the rescue boat. <sighs> Should make for a long entertaining video though. Maybe that's the trick is just to push from the side. Oh, she gets slippery. All right. <laughs> I guess it's stuck there for a while. It'll be all right. All right, let's open this guy up and lean him out a bit. At least nothing's actually broken. Uh, let's set this over here so we don't lose anything. All right, screwdriver. All right, so I think we're going to lean this guy out. Wow, that's so loose. That's so loose. Oh, man. I wonder if this uh, O-ring is crapped out on us now. Well, only one way to find out. Lean it out and throw it back in. So we put a good turn on it. Let's uh, get it fired back up and throw it back in the water. It would be really nice if you could start this without the top on it.
immediately dies out. get this one figured out so <clears throat> I think I realized that the upper needle or the high-end needle seems like it might be leaking so I think we're gonna pull it all the way out take a look at the uh, o-ring in it and if it's not good then we're probably gonna try something the old hybrid trick screwdriver you can tell it looks like it's real wet and it's super loose I'm here I'm here buddy Yeah, he's pretty, pretty flat. He sticks out a little bit, but not a whole lot. And it's definitely, I think stuff is seeping past it. All right, let me see what I got here. Yeah, old Milwaukee. Conserve battery power here. Even if this don't work, I don't care about this O-ring. I got more at home. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this monkey off. I don't care. This is what happens when you take your work to work every day. I don't even know where I picked up tape at. All right, there it goes. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna steal a little chunk of line. All right, let's see. Stuff that back on there real good. Right. I think my piece needs to be just a little bit thinner. Trim him up just a little bit if we can. Starting to get that do it on the bench feeling. 
There we go. Alright. So now, we're going to slip him in place of the O-ring. If we can. Oh my god. Go on there. Just go to your new home. Don't you want to go to your home? It's got that nitro oil on it. It's kind of slippery. Yeah, let's try this. There we go. All right, so got him up there in the groove. Hopefully we can run him in. Morning. I don't know if it wants to go, but it's gonna go. And the radio keeps beeping at me. I got it to go in, but I think it just pushed it right out. <laughs> oh, that's some hood rat shit right there. Did it get all of it or? Oh. Might have to try again with dinner piece. Fuck that up. Alright, that's a little better. Let's try that. Yeah, now we're down in there. I don't know though, that doesn't seem like it's really sealed very well. I'll try it. So on this one it is all the way down. Half, one, half, two, half. I'll take it back to a quarter because that's pretty lean. Or uh, rich for break-in. Then their factory settings. Let's see if it'll even start for us. I guess you might actually want that.
ใช่Well, we got her to idle and run. That's good. All right. So I think we're gonna lean out that high side about eighth of a turn. See how we feel. Oh yeah, she's still pretty cold. Give her a good little bit. Throw the top back on. Throw her back out. Shit, you might want to start it first. Very, very important part. Why didn't you guys tell me? You didn't even help me out. I don't have a spare. Well, screw it. I'm throwing it up there without the lid. Hopefully, we don't fake it. It's playing games today. It's still pretty rich.
I'm gonna say now she don't want to die. <laughs> Come on, wind, push it back. <laughs> oh, rescue boat having no reverse is not cool. Let's pay for we come back around. Come here. Oh, she picked up some water. Is that the nut in there? Maybe I got lucky and dropped it inside. It is. All right, well, we'll try to fish that out. Can you guys see that? It took on quite a bit of water. That's all right, I feel like it needed a bath. Well, she's only down about halfway on fuel. I think we're gonna give her another hour on the high side. Top it up, start it and throw the top back on it and uh, see what she does. I wanna look. Lost it right there. I know it sounds like she's chugging along, but uh, 
I just had it pretty leaned out and uh, it didn't do very well. Oh well, as Hybrid says, she's running rich and loud. It really has a problem with the prop being up too high. I'm not sure if it's vibrated back up or if uh, it just won't allow it to go down far enough for the boat. Once it's planted, it's good, but when it slows down or it takes those tight turns, it always wants to uh, do that. It's not really the fastest boat on the water, but it sure is fun to drive. Makes all the right noises. Very, very minute inputs for this to turn. You see how much I'm turning there? Anything more than that and it will flip. But if you're real delicate, she goes, man.
Sorry if I'm getting you guys with the reflection from the sun a bit. It's uh, honestly starting to get in my eyes too. Sounds like she's starting to get unhappy. We're going to let her slow boat around for a while. See, it's so high in the rear front. It really is a fun boat to just kind of coast around, but I think she about died on me there. It really does like to load up in the low throttle. She might be taking on water too. Yeah, I think when we bring the big boat out, we're going to have to go over there to the dock for sure. It's fun to rip around the corner with this thing, but uh, out there, we're going to have way more room. Be able to see it better. things run for a good long while like I said I don't even think I put more fuel in it <laughs> that's probably the inside of me saying you should bring it in no nah, maybe I topped it up I think I did actually Ha <laughs> ha. 
Is that a boat donut? I think next time around we're gonna uh, just let her idle and let her die where she does and probably call it that. Oh, perfecto.